you like the warm weather and you're a warm weather person, enjoy it now because Mary's going to tell us it's going to be gone here pretty quick. It is. We have a couple more days left with temperatures pretty mild. We actually started off this morning a little bit on the cooler side, so a nice little taste of fall, but that's not going to be the case tonight. It's going to be another warm one. Right now we are at 71 degrees. We have those winds out of the southwest pumping in that warmer air. So temperatures expected to get to the upper 70s later on, but we need those clouds to exit the region and high pressure is going to help with that. That warm front lifting to the north and then we have that cold front that's going to be moving in, bringing us showers mostly late tomorrow night through Saturday. So we still have a few clouds hanging around through this morning, starting to see them break apart just a little bit, but all in all still going to be a mild day and mainly quiet. Just a very small chance for a stray shower to pop up. We did have a few of those and you can see a little bit of green there into Beaver County, but just a sprinkle or two. Our temperatures are warming up for areas further to the west, places like Beaver Falls at 74, made it to 70 Newcastle and Butler still at 70 there in Greensburg and still in the upper 60s at 66 for Catanning. Our dew points are in the low 60s, but those are starting to increase, so we're starting to get more moisture into the atmosphere, and this is all ahead of that cold front. So we're going to see those showers arriving very early tomorrow. Scattered showers at that. The bulk of the rain, again, will be late Friday through much of the day Saturday, at least the first portion of the day. We'll have sunshine by dinner time temperatures into the upper 70s and then into the mid 60s through overnight. So it's been a very warm October. The past really October's on record, the top five warmest through the first two weeks. So really through the past decades, this decade, we're looking at temperatures still well above average. So top four uh, have been in the past decade. So it's been warm and you're not wrong if it's been pretty warm the past several October. So rain arrives overnight Friday and last through Saturday into the afternoon. We're going to have a few pockets of heavier rain at times, but then sweater weather returns. So after that rain, it's going to get a lot more comfortable as we head throughout the weekend. So Saturday temperatures are going to fall through the day. That's about our midnight temperature and then we'll see them through the daytime about one o'clock in the afternoon and two o'clock into the mid 50s, but sunny for our Sunday with highs around 60. So let's time out this rain for you. Scattered showers through the morning tomorrow, very light rain, and then we start to see that pick up as that cold front crosses. So late Friday night for football games may just get a spotty shower. The bulk of that rain will be overnight through very early Saturday morning. So once this front passes, we're going to see those break apart afternoon daytime temperatures into the mid 50s. So it's going to be a bit cooler, maybe even a shock to the system for a lot of us. And then we start to see a lot of sunshine for our Sunday. So best chance of rain will be Saturday today, upper 70s, not shaking the warm weather just yet. Mid 60s overnight tomorrow making a run for 80 degrees again. So by the weekend, mid 60s, that's going to be our high than falling temperatures through the day. Cooler mornings ahead. Temperatures will be in the low 40s, mid 40s for the weekend for Sunday and next week. We're staying into the mid to upper 60s, a sunny Monday, Tuesday, mostly sunny skies and Wednesday nearing 70.